is Jared with Thomas Crane. I am 9 years old and I am in 4th grade. Today I am going to be showing you on how to make an image recognizer app on Thumbsplash. So I will share my screen. Page recognizer. Image recognizer. So there are three labels so one, two, three. You have to make two of the labels empty. So make this empty and make this also empty. And now I'm gonna name label three. Rename this as confidence. Um, yes. Yep, that's done. And now the other label will remain empty. So now we are going to have to add image. Okay, and now for the invisible company. So we'll add image recognizer. And then next we will add a camera. Now so these are two the, the two invisible components. And yeah, so now we're gonna have to do something else. Hmm. Yeah, so this is all the components we need. So now we're gonna go to screen one. You can edit the background color just a little bit, just for some decoration. Or you can just put another background picture from Google, like uploading it. So now we're gonna go and move on to the coding. So now we're gonna go to button one. Where's button one? Oh yeah, forgot about the button. So now we're gonna add the button here and put it here. Yellow label. And now you can name the button if you want. So now we're gonna go to button one. On button one, click. And then we're gonna go to camera one. We have to put this thing on camera one called take photo. And then we have to do something in then go. So that means we have to go to image one. This one. Then we have to put photo here. That's done. Okay, so now we have to go to the invisible component and put in image recognizer call upload. Okay, so this is what this is all the other things, other things we have to do. Now image we have to replace that with photo. And now we're gonna go have to go to label two, the empty one. From label two set text. So this is the one. Yep. From label two set text. Hmm, I think it's exactly okay so now next we have to go to conference and then I try to go to conference set text to conference level and then next we have to move from tag set text to tags okay I think that's a label so we'll just add a label Label. Then we have blue button one. Okay, blue button one. And then make this empty. And we rename it as tags. Okay, so now that will be over here now. So now we have to go to tags, and now we have to add from tag set text to tags. Okay, so. One tag set text to yeah this is the one I'm just go down a little bit and then set tags to tags set text to tag okay so after all this the coding should be complete so now let's start 
doing the live test. Okay, we're in the live test now. So then when you click the button, so you can pause whenever you, so you can pause or you can do whatever pause you want. So I'll just Yep, I did it. So now yeah. So and now we're describe the picture just like this. And this is a young man sitting in front of a laptop. Glasses boy striped looking using something. Yep, so this is what you will get if you do all the coding for this app. And this is what this is how uh, the app works.